Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Poppy's Playtime. Chapter 3. Uh, last time, um, Ollie gave us a key. Now he said that there's another key that's somewhere. In, oh, no. It's home sweet home. Not gonna lie. Don't know where home sweet home is. Uh, I don't think I got a cassette. I wonder where it could be. Okay, we need to go find Home Sweet Home anyway. I wonder if that means I have to leave this area. Yeah, I was right. The door closed behind me. Oh, Huggy Wuggy, it's Pugapella. I don't think I went to the statue. Where could it be? Un I don't think that's the statue. I think I could go here yet. It's locked. To the statue. How do be this? Things have changed, though. That's <laughs> Litter stops here. Um, there it is. Restore power in home sweet home. Oh, ironically enough, the house is... The one we walked up to is the one we need to go to. We just didn't have the key. So that key did blend in pretty well. Oh no. Oh no. No, no, no. Oh crap. Oh, here's the hallucinogenic.
Oh. I don't like this. Oh, I don't like this. <laughs> Tragic news this morning, as of 9.45 a.m., local authorities report that the body of a young boy has been found on the estate of the late Elliot Ludwig, an esteemed toy maker and originator of the Playtime Company. At this time, an identity for the child awaits official confirmation. Found in an upstairs bedroom in a large duffel bag, officers on scene report that the remains appear to have been disturbed. Organs as well as key bones from the skeletal structure were reported missing from the body. It is unknown at this time whether this extraction was, in fact, the cause of death. Okay. I don't know if I went the right way or not. Following recent events, Playtime Co. was uh -oh. asked for any comment regarding the discovery. This is what they had to say. Quote, It's sickening. Elliot Ludwig was a great man. And those who knew him understood that he was not capable of violence, let alone what others now claim. He had a deep love in his heart for children like this one. Making the actions of whoever planted this body all the more sick. We look forward to clear his good name, both in the public eye and in the eyes of the law. Stay tuned for more. A clap and a half to you. We'll miss you. Playtime Co. was asked for any comment regarding the discovery. This is what they had to say. Quote, it's sickening. Elliot Ludwig was a great... I don't like this. What do you mean I need to run? I don't I don't have the ability to run. Despite Playtime's proclamation of Ludwig's innocence, many believe his reclusive and mysterious the hell, it's all changed. The previous decades lend suspicion to this claim. When questioned, Ludwig's neighbors indicated that he would often return to his home in strange hours of the night and depart again before sunrise. I want to hear the report, but at the same time I don't want to stand still. What is that? I'm on my home. What the fuck? Guilt haunts you. What? 
What is this? What is this? <laughs> what did I see? A, a computer? Here? Guilt haunts you. Um... Just, I'll just keep going down this dark hallway. Nothing's ever bad happened, right? Oh, did he? Huggy -wuggy. Greetings, employees, and welcome to your first day here in Playtime. We're certain that in the days to come, you'll find your new family here every bit as loving and supportive as your own. Feel free to wander the halls, sit in the mess for lunch, or watch our children play and learn to their little hearts' content. Join the innovationists where the bounds of science are continuously pushed. Or join the counselors of Playcare whose diligence and care for our children will help shape a brighter future. Just you see. Now, every one of you has your part in that future, so should you come back tomorrow feeling unhappy for where you are, or what you've done, worry not, for your supervisor is here and happy to listen. And, should you come back years later, your conscience finally getting the better of you, May you descend into the dark and the dust, finding all that awaits you are incomprehensible horrors, each hungry for your return, each eager that they might find you. Perhaps they'd smile at you from a shadow, their smiling mouths full of teeth and meat and plastic, watching and waiting patiently for their turn at a warm welcome. Or perhaps they won't allow you such time to figure your place in the world you'd left, a world that's theirs now. Welcome home. Oh! Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. Um, uh, um, no? Oh god, it, it's a bigger huggy wuggy. How to run. Oh fuck. God damn it. I got gotten. I couldn't sprint. Oh, I was was I supposed to be getting? I I was. It was all an acid trip. Oh, there's daddy long legs. <laughs> there's... I fell in a hole. Vroom, vroom.
I feel like I wasn't supposed to come down here, just you. Or maybe I was, because there's no way back up. Oh! Got a gas mask on. But I don't know where to go. Who can't go that way? There's gotta be something with you. There is. Okay. Okay, there's gotta be something in this area. That's why you were forced to go. Like, going up. Got it. Yep, that's it. Upward. Oh, so creepy with kids now. Oh. oh, I got it. I'm instead of me going over it, I should be trying to go under it. there a TV there's got to be a cassette somewhere right in here where could a cassette be Subject is stable. Designated 1322. Clear neural abnormalities were detected in his recent checkup. Though highly irregular, we've pulled him from the home sweet home just before lights out to perform. What are you doing with my friend? I. What are you doing out of bed? How did you get in here? Is Kevin sick? Why did you take him away? I. I. Yes. Kevin is very sick. Very, very sick. 
We want to make him better. But he can only get better if we take him to where we can provide proper care and give him proper rest. Well, do you really think he will be okay? I should think so. We're good at what we do, son. We paid attention in school, learned, and got our proper rest when we needed it. Just like you need it now, I should think. Come now. Let's get you on back to bed. Uh, okay. It's been a pleasure meeting you, Joseph. And I promise you, your friend will be all right. When you see him again, he'll have never been better. Yeah, I don't feel any better. And uh, this is where we're going to end the video. I hope everybody has enjoyed it. I will see you guys next time.